cashless society is a clean society. Cashless society is a simple and progressive society. When we talk about cashless transactions, we necessarily think about paying a huge hotel bill or shopping at a department store using a credit or debit card, right? So let me take you to a place where you can buy even a pan through cashless transactions. Get your cycle repaired. Get your daily vegetables too through cashless transactions. This is the Gujarat Narmada Valley Fertilizers and Chemicals Limited Township in Bharuj, Gujarat. It boasts of a thousand houses with a population of 4,500 people. An additional 5,500 people work for the company. Within this township, there are a number of provision stores, school, hospital, a stadium, a restaurant, and various eateries. When the Honorable Prime Minister gave a clarion call to the nation to adopt cashless transactions, the people at GNFC Township decided to go cashless. As a result, the dry cleaners' bills are paid through pause machines. The hospital slip is made through e-wallet only. Even a cup of tea in this township is purchased with credit or debit card. School fees are also not deposited in cash anymore. This is a progressive industrial township. Where in the last few days, GNFC through their thousand retail stores have sold fertilizers to over 50,000 farmers through cashless transactions. There are over 180 such industrial townships with a population of over 5 lakhs in the state of Gujarat alone. Pan India, the number of such companies and townships run into thousands. GNFC has set an example for others to follow. With just a little determination, some hard work and an effective management, the country can have many such townships, which will prove to be a guiding light for the big cities to go cashless. So let our New Year resolution for the year 2017 be that all of us living in the big industrial townships or any other integrated townships in India adopt the cashless method and become a sterling example to the nation.